Hi guys, two items in the post bag today. One local from the UK, and one from China. Oh, Singapore. Quantity and detailed description of contents. Module. Hmm. Well, I'm pretty sure I know what this is. It's something for my radio control gear. never seen one before it might look a little bit odd you got a plug there to go to your battery and two more plugs there to plug into something and then that goes to your receiver and it's a light switch as I understand it so I shall rig it up to something and see if we can make that work. It's for, as I say, turning lights on and off on your boat or your plane. But it runs off, put a LiPo battery on there, so depending on what battery you put on there, depends on what power you get out there. So that's that one, we might have a quick look at that. And then the other one I think will be pretty boring. I think it's a memory card. Yeah, there we are. 32 gig memory card. That's supposed to be for my new dash cam for the car. Because I ordered a new one because I thought the old one had gone 40. But I've since fixed the old one. So we might be using the new dash camera, so, uh, well, put it on the car and the boat and the plane and that sort of thing. Oh, probably not the plane, probably too big. But the car and the boat, it might work. So we'll see. Anyway, I'll go and rig something up so we can try this out. Just for demonstration purposes, I've rigged it up to my little boat here. Um, at the moment, Put that in place. Oops, wrong one. So that's the steering. But if I take it out and plug this little unit in, so I'm using my three AAA batteries to power it, so that's four and a half volts. And I've got some LEDs there that can actually take that four and a half volts without burning out straight away. I say four and a half, they're 1.2, so that's 3.6 volts. So it's not far off the right value. So if I stick this in the steering position, or channel one, then flick it once. We've got the lights on. Um, they're actually flickering LEDs, so that's giving you a bit of a false effect. But they are a light. Flick it again. Intermittent, uh, not intermittent, alternative flash. Flick it again. Both flashing together. Permanently on. Alternative flash both flashing. So there we go, that's our um, well, lights switch, radio controlled light switch. Very simple. Not sure what I can use it for, but it does the job. I suppose I could use it to turn on lights on a car. Yeah, could do. What would be nice would be if I could use it to control the indicators, but that isn't an option. 
You've just got three different settings, well, four different settings if you include off. So there we go, that's today's post bag.